All right, y'all. Oh, I'm sorry about the lighting. Should be brighter. I don't know why it's not brighter. Anyway, um, this is actually April 30th. <laughs> I said it was the 29th earlier in the other video. Well, I'm probably going to combine all the videos and make one video for this fruit run. I took a video of us at New Generation with all the stuff. I took a video of what we got, you know, myself, Maritza, and Federico. It's good to go in groups when you do fruit hauls because you can get more variety. I'm just reminding you guys. You can get more variety of things. Um, and you know, there's people who, who got your back there. Me, I'm a bargainer. I'm always bargaining. I'm looking, always looking for the most overripe fruit, you know, um, to bargain for. You know what I'm saying? So it's always good to go with, you know, three heads are better than one for sure. And also three sets of arms are better than one. And a vehicle is even better. So thanks to Marita for that. So I'm going to show you, um, part, part of me, allergies. I'm going to show you the spoils, um, as I have them laid out, uh, and, uh, yeah, just, just to show you what I'm going to be eating for the next two, two, two and a half weeks. Two to two and a half weeks. Um, so, where's the receipt? Actually, let me pick up the receipt real quick. Um, so, here's the receipt. Um, and it shows you the prices. So, um, uh, here's the apricots. This is the 88 apricots. And we ended up getting these... Um, uh, one a dollar thirty three a pound, which is excellent. You know, that a dollar thirty three a pound usually like you get apples, cheap apples. You know, for that amount of money. Um, so we ended up getting you know wholesale a dollar thirty three a pound, and of course we split it three ways. So end up being like um eleven dollars um for us each. But again, you know it's wholesale and they sh they sell it in bulk, and so that's a good that's a good deal, because it, it was thirty two dollars. Let me see. So thirty two dollars. All right. So four dollars. Um, so the mangoes, we, um, me and Federico, we did three and a half boxes, two and a half boxes of mangoes, and I think, um, two and a half, two and a half, and then Maritza did, like, one box that we sort of added, um, mangoes, mixed mangoes. We got different kinds of mangoes. We got the, the large, um, Atalfa mangoes, I think some of those at the bottom. So these mangoes were diff are different than, um, the small, these small ones here. I think these, they have the Marc Descabello uh, mangoes. Yeah, close up, close up. Yeah, right. So, but anyway, um, you know, and again, we, especially me, I look for the ripe right now so that they can give us the best deal. Um, a box of these mangoes, um, I think these are the, uh, they call them Haitian mangoes. For some reason, I thought the Atalfo and the Haitians were the same. Maybe they're not. Somebody, you know, correct me if I'm wrong. But these were in a different box, and these we got for $7 a box. They were trying to sell it to us 8 or whatever. And if I just, you know, wanted to, I would have bargained more. But I was just like, alright, fine, whatever. We're splitting it three ways. So I think these come like um seven in the box or something like that i feel like it was more you'll see it in in the previous in the, in the previous uh video um that um there's a few of these in the box i think it's about three three six no i think it's about ten something like that and it was seven dollars so um no it definitely wasn't seven in in, in, in the box because i would never 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 have um uh, bought Mangoes wholesale a dollar each. So I think it must have been like 10 or 12 in the box. But anyway, it was $7. Um, these mangoes, um, we got them $6 a box. Um, and uh, we, we bought three. Um, these mangoes right here, we got them $4 a box. As you can see, they are ready yesterday. They're all wrinkly. And these are the ones I look for because they taste good. They're fine. They're just like, they're not something that the grocery stores really want to sell. So they don't buy these. So... I mean, new generation is looking for people like us who are going to buy these and give them some money for it as opposed to them, you know, getting too ripe and then having to trash them. So, you know, by buying wholesale, you save yourself some money and the businesses, you helping them as well because they would just waste this, this money. And, and I'm sure they throw away a lot of fruit. So go there every week, see what's popping over there um, and see if you can salvage some fruit that you can actually eat. So as I said... We got three boxes of the uh, those wrinkly ones, four dollars. I mentioned the one that was seven dollars. I guess they're ten. Okay, ten in the box. Sixteen um, for the other one. So we got sixteen Capco or uh, Talfo mangoes, and then sixteen an another variety of Talfo mangoes, and one was four dollars, one was six dollars. Um, we got the orange, the navel oranges, the eighty-eight in a box. We got for seventeen dollars, which is two dollars less than last time. Um, I guess it all depends on market value. Uh, last time it was 19 and we, we, me and Leah bought the box and we split it. 
um but 17 um and we got two two boxes so we all went home with 59 58 and then one of us went home 59 i don't know which one i think maybe maritza i don't remember if i took 59 or not maybe it was me but yeah so there's oranges underneath these mangoes here and um but most of the oranges are here and these are it doesn't look like 59 mangoes but it's 50 i mean i'm sorry oranges um uh, but it is 59 um again the whole bottom layer of this basket has oranges in it um last time i got 44 so i guess 15 more it just doesn't look that different um out of curiosity i don't know why it looks so little two four six eight um ten twelve whatever it's i counted them before i put it in my little cart there so it's it's 59 or 58 um the bananas it wasn't a great deal because they're like you know good looking bananas they're not so ripe you know usually we go for the overripe bananas that they're trying to get rid of and that's why they sell those so low maybe that's next time it is a saturday morning and um you know normally my normal times is the afternoon when all the retailers have bought all their stuff and you know i'm looking for what's left but it wasn't terrible um a box um was they, they sell it to us eighteen dollars um again you know they, i couldn't really bargain i should have anyway couldn't really bargain when they look like this and not overripen with brown spots so these are five bunches one two three four five bunches I pretty much got them for a dollar each, which is not terrible. It still is wholesale. It still is less than what I would pay in a grocery store. Um, so that's fine. But I'm, you know, I'm a frugal fruitarian. I'm super frugal. So, and I know that a lot of fruit, enough fruit spoils in the tropics to feed the whole planet. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to take the spoils, if you, you know, literally. Um, not completely spoiled, but stuff that they don't want to sell and they would end up trashing. So... I'm frugal, and it makes sense. I'm like a gleaner, almost, to the wholesale people, you know. It's like, okay, I come in the afternoon. All the retailers have bought their stuff wholesale. What you got left? What's ripe right, right now? What doesn't look good to sell? What box is damaged? Because sometimes um, they will sell you a cheap box um, of perfect fruit that's, like, ripe right now, but not too ripe because the box is damaged. And I, ha I did that one time, and I ended up... I swear to God, it was like 80 pounds of bananas because whatever they're selling right now for 40 pounds does not look like 40 pounds. Maybe it is 40 pounds. So what I got like a couple months ago was maybe like about 80 pounds. Um, and it was 12 bucks as opposed, to, as opposed to 17 because the box was damaged. But the bananas themselves were perfect. No, no, nothing wrong with them. Anyway, back to the video. Um, or back to the fruit, rather. So I'll show you the apricots. Um, the mangoes. I'm so excited about the mangoes. I mean, the great thing about this... You know, when I wasn't fruitarian and I was just eating, you know, I love fruit, always love fruit. But, you know, when I was living a cooked food vegan lifestyle, I used to buy fruit very sparingly because, you know, buying fruit retail is not all that. It's not cheap, you know. I mean, it's cheaper than buying meat or anything like that, but it's not so cheap. So I used to like, you know, little, you know, oh, let me have one mango today, one mango tomorrow. What? I'm hungry right now. I'm hungry. I ran out of fruit. I ran out of oranges on Thursday. Today's Saturday. Yesterday... I managed to find a melon in the house and some avocados my roommate left. You know, she's away for the month, so, you know, she's not going to eat them. I'll replace them when she gets back. You know, I don't just eat people's stuff like that. But I was like, wow, I mean, <laughs> I'm, I'm hungry. No food, no food to eat. And, of course, there's, like, you know, other stuff, you know, in the house. But, you know, I eat fruit, so, for the most part. So, um for me, I'm just like, oh my god, I'm, I'm, I'm you know, so I'm, I haven't eaten anything, and it's already noon. We went, we left here at 8 o'clock, and whatever, but anyway. So I'm, I'm glad that I can eat as many mangoes as I want. I'm four, five, six, and I'm not, I don't feel like, man, like I'm, you know, draining my pockets, you know. I'm, I'm looking at this, and there's so much abundance here, and I'm just like, I'm good to go. I'm gonna eat my four or five mangoes. And think about it, you know, fruit is so nutrient dense. You know, especially the ones that are grown in good soils that after four mangoes, <laughs> I mean, you good. You feel, you you know, you feel satisfied. Anyway, last thing. So we got the bananas, the mangoes, the apricots, the oranges. We got some loquats. So Federico spotted the loquats. I spotted the loquats who I didn't know they were loquats because I've never seen them fresh before. But we got some of those. It wasn't... um. 
the cheapest thing around. It was three dollars. I think ended up being three dollars for like uh, each of these. It's twelve in a box. Um, we all took four. It was forty two dollars. My math might be wrong, but it wasn't. It wasn't terrible. You know what I mean? Um, so we got some low quad, something new for me to try. I, you know, again, I love this lifestyle because I'm always trying new fruit. I'm open to trying new fruit. Um, and so I saw it and I was like, I gotta try these. And then, um, so again, as I mentioned, um, before, um, if you haven't tried mangosteen, that's one of those things you need to try. Um, Federico saw a box of mangosteen and the guy said it was a hundred dollars a box and we were like, no, thank you. And, um, they're really nice at new generation. So they found a box of overripe, um, mangosteen and, oh, I'm sorry, did I say box or bag? They found a bag for us and they gave us a bag. So we split the bag. So, so, um, I've talked a lot on this video. I'm sorry, even though like I have allergies and I shouldn't be talking at all. I should be just drinking water and doing acupuncture myself and exercising or whatever. But anyway, this is what I got today. And, um, feel free to leave comments, um, ask questions and, uh, have a beautiful day. We, we did good today. We did good. Look, we did, we did good. So this is two weeks. You know, I mean, we indulged a little bit. We indulged with the with the apricots. We indulged the loquats. Other than that, this would have been a really cheap buy. Um, like cheaper than than you know normal. Normally, like I'll go to uh, to New Generation uh, and I'd spend. I'd want to spend like twenty twenty five dollars for the two weeks, and that's like what twelve fifty a week, and that would be all my food pretty much, aside from you know buying some nuts and then that's it. So I could literally live off of like thirteen dollars a week. You know. Uh, at New Gen. Again, today we, we went a little, you know, we spoiled ourselves a little bit. We got the apricots, we got the loquats. Those are the only things that were really like out of, you know, uh, you know, normal, above normal price of, you know, basic things like bananas and mangoes and oranges. But yeah, $27 for a week. That's normally how much I spend or uh, aim to spend per week, about $25-ish on food. So it's still cheap. So for me, two weeks, 27 bucks, I'm good. I'm buy buy a couple of you know, uh, like a few ounces of some, some almonds or whatever. And then I'm good to go 30 ish dollars a week. So, so good. So anyway, um, subscribe to the channel, Michael Fruitarian. Um, and yeah, I'm going to post more fruit hauls and more deals that I find around New York city. And, um, again, feel free to ask questions and leave comments. So deuces.